Welcome everyone, this is Kremble from Emotionless Crypto Trading. Today I'd like to speak about Bitcoin and handle the most important details. We would like to be very, very much on the data of the market and share with you the most important price point in order to help you with a trading process, understanding the market behavior and the language of the charts. We're going to dive into the most important details in a matter of a few seconds. We're a couple of days into September and things are moving better than August. A lot of the people are back from holidays. Uh, either they started trading or others have started getting back into their investment type of uh, doing business. Uh, we have two active type of traders. We have the daily traders, which are doing this business every single day professionally. And we have the daily people not doing this thing professionally, taking off days, weeks, months, and getting back into different periods of the year, depending on how the natural schedule is going on in the society for a average Joe, for example, right? So for an average guy. That is the two type of energies that are right here driving the market and on top of those two it is always the existent one which is always into the game it's permanently trading and those are the institutions groups of traders anything that is related to professional as a group as a company of trading and i'm sure that makes sense to you so September used to be, from statistics perspective, one of the months where things are picking up to great numbers from the volume perspective. The only thing that we would have to be aware of is where are going to be the breakouts and what kind of lines are going to sustain us in order to predict a better future of the market. So we're going to dive into that over the next few seconds as September is great for those. Let me tell you one more thing before that is the private coaching program, which you probably already know about if you're watching my videos, scramblecoaching.com, link down in the description or comments area for those of you looking to become professional traders uh, through my four weeks of intensive private coaching directly with me program out there with lifetime support afterwards. Make sure you check the entire website, read everything on it, watch all the videos we have right here, all the numbers down below with a number of students, number of trade, amount of money they made and all kinds of things. And then you can register right now. I'm going to reply you in 24 hours to your email. Make sure you check that out. And then we can have a free 15 minute conversation discussing about it if you'd like to know more. Then you can decide to join or not really up to you that's all about this then going towards basically my telegram group where i'm posting about all the videos i'm sharing online youtube even though you subscribe is not really notifying people telegram can notify you especially if you join my group so make sure you join scramble crypto and turn on the notifications of this group this way, you know, every time, whenever I'm posting, so you're ready to join the video and watch the educational content, which is the purpose of my materials. Going towards the BTC, this is what we have for today. Two hour candlestick for BTC paired up with the US dollar, a critical situation as we are touching a major resistance line zone. I'm sorry, it's not a line, it's a zone around eleven thousand dollars right and we're just right here but let me tell you what happened in the last couple of days as this current chart is representing a couple of details of the past and some useful uh, patterns out there first we got very very nicely supported by the nine thousand dollars major structure area and not line right so for sure we got supported by that and here we had a very very impressive rejection by the market where bulls reacted very very fast they pushed the market back to high levels and from there we did enter into a uptrending channel the subtrending channel has a weak level of uptrending channel support line this green one right here which goes 
up just like that at the moment it is still considered weak to the logic and context of the current situation other things that happened in a couple of in the last couple of days with a BTC was the long breakout which happened here and that was a clear entry to go long on trading another thing which was pretty nice was the weak pullback pattern right there where we could have expected a second swing right the second swing is appearing right afterwards that green swing right there do the weak pullback compared to the increase after the breakout which represents 5.7 and the pullback is 1.36 keep in mind the fact that if the pullback is no bigger than 50 percent the pattern of the pullback is bullish if the pullback is bigger than 50 percent then the entire structure transforms into a bearish one so clearly here we have 5.63 50 percent out of this increase that's just what we have to calculate it's 50 percent out of the increase you had so 5.6 50 percent is probably uh what's that 2.8 the pullback was about 1.2 1.3 maximum right so that is totally not anywhere close to 50 percent out of the increase percentage great we also had the confirmation of the pattern appearing on the second swing just like that and again we were able to form higher lows very very simply confirming on the line in a beautiful way and right now finding the resistance at eleven thousand dollars major resistance zone going towards to the two hour candlesticks this is what we have utilizing here a fibonacci retracement tool which is very efficient on the current chart this is where we are eleven thousand dollars decision point uh, which is also represented by the Fibonacci extension uh, right there we had another confirmation which was very very powerful what's happening above well we have another Fibonacci at 0 0.618 appearing at 11,200 decision point right here so if we break out this is where you need to expect resistance if we break out out of this as well you have to expect resistance at 0 0.78 Fibonacci which is 11,500 up to 11,700 decision point here these are the places you will have to expect to short the market what's happening if the market is basically not capable of breaking out of the current resistance and we are going to get hit by the bears you have to consider this that we have a 0.382 Fibonacci extension at eleven thousand dollars five hundred dollars sorry eleven thousand five hundred bucks right there that's where you can expect for support which is by the way great as it's going to form a higher low as well from the previous one take a look at that we had a low here another one here another one here and we could have another one here all forming a very nice uptrending support line so that would be great that wouldn't be a disaster if we get resistance right now wouldn't be a problem for our uptrending possibilities out there it's just even better because you have the chance to confirm on the bottom side which tells you the upcoming movement could go above the previous top which is here so the upcoming movement could go above the previous stop which means to break out of 0 0.5 Fibonacci go towards and attack the 0 0.618 Fibonacci right this is basically what we have to consider as a probability and it wouldn't be any sort of a problem to see this of course any sort of representation it is extremely difficult to be made as an exact movement of the candlestick that's why traders are not talking about the design and aesthetical part of the candlestick they talk about price points where we expect reactions so we see 
the price point and we react on that action of the market on that price point. So we know how to do this as long as we know the price where the market is going to react. We see the action on the charts and we react to that. This is how we make money long-term trading. This is how we live from trading and this is what you learn during the coaching program. You have as well the 10,300 decision point right here. If everything breaks below, bears are getting to dominate. Uh, you have the support appearing right there again. Good point to entry for long. And the long-term details. Long-term details are obviously looking like this for one day candlestick. And here we have two situations. As you guys can see right now, in the past, we had some very strong resistances appearing at the similar prices, just the way we are right now. Plus, right here at the top, if we get pushed by the heavy resistance line of the downtrending resistance line of the triangle, if we get hit by that here, which is a very, very powerful resistance line attention it's a heavy one if we get hit by that then there is high probabilities to lose the support on the uh, trending line and fall below the structure which would mean pretty much the end of the uptrending era as of right now so currently what you have here starting from this point going like that you have a structure of uptrend if the market breaks below this, this structure is transforming from uptrend into downtrend as a total environment. That's very, very important to consider that the structure has its last point on $9,000. So whatever movement is closing below $9,000 with no reaction by the bulls to bring back up the market just like they did it couple of times once here twice there and three times over there with multiple candlesticks in each scenario if that does not happen we enter into a bearish environment which is going to take us again a long period to get back from it so this is why the current situation september it is extremely important because as you can see here down below we have the october and the October is pretty much the end of the triangle. So until that, we must see a decision, which means December is the big month out there. It's the big date out there. We, we need to see something. Right now, we're going towards the resistance point. And we are actually dominating from the bull's perspective, which is great. But let's see what's happening at 11,500 if we have the capability to touch that over the next few days we just have to be patient enough and wait for it it's going to be great as long as the market is following the previous structures and charts as well and breaks out all these points make sure you keep your eyes on it and react on the market guys because you can make a lot of the money by trading instead of leaving tons of money on the table if you don't know how to do this you can apply to my coaching program and we can learn that thing just like anything else in life, this thing can be learned. And it needs to be learned. Otherwise, there's 99% chances you're going to lose money on long term, which means minimum six months of trading. It is extremely difficult without the knowledge to do something in life. And it's basically uh, a action by any rational human being to learn first before doing it. Just like you want to think first before talking, just like you want to prepare first before acting. There's always something you have to do before the main action. Beautiful. So that's kind of all about for today. For those of you looking to stay in touch, Telegram is the best place. Make sure you join. Link down below in the description area. Then you will know all, all around my videos whenever I'm posting because YouTube is definitely not notifying people these days. Uh, other things related to this is pretty much the private coaching program at scramblecoaching.com. And it's kind of all about, guys. We see some great signs in September. Market is moving. 
Look at that, even Ethereum is picking up. Ripple, which is trying to survive at 25, 26 cents. Litecoin 67, BTC Cash, nothing special, but they were able to uh, surpass Litecoin on the market cap. Feather is used at extremely high levels already. Take a look at that, guys. Today, guess who has the highest volume? Feather insane 17.9 billion dollars on the table more than btc so today we have an altcoin holding rank number one into the volume take a look at this these two guys here feather and btc has 33 billion more actually 34.4 billion dollars volume in the last 24 hours Compared to the entire 52 from the overall market, you have 34. That's very, very good. That's 18 billions left for the other 2,646. And I hope my math is good. I'm doing it directly without doing any sort of calculations uh, with any technical tools. Just my little brain. Beautiful, guys. That's pretty much all about for today. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you stay in touch. I'm looking to share with you continuous educational content, and hopefully I can do it. Thank you. We'll talk to you soon.